Namaskar, how are you? I'm good. Hello, how are you? There are certain people you grow up reading about, you watch them on television, you hear stories about them. And today, when I saw Mr. Gandhi, I was blown. I'm Rahul, I'm Congress President. Uh, and I'm a uh, member, member of Parliament from Amati and I thought I'd have a chat with some young people and get a sense of what they're thinking. So there is a rule that has been brought that 10% of reservation, right? So for what extent it seems genuine or it seems good to the nation? Suppose we are sitting at dinner. Yes. There's no food on the table. Yes. And we say, you know what we're going to do? We're going to reserve what's on the table for all of you. What's going to be the result of that? The bottom line in India today is there are no jobs. So you can reserve anything you want. The fact of the matter is, China is producing 50,000 jobs every 24 hours and India is producing 450. You're facing a massive crisis. So with the interaction with him was like uh, similar to what we discuss in our wings in IIT itself. He was so friendly and even he was serving to us. Sir, you don't think it's a service or a right to education. The government is the soul, the soul, the soul, the soul, the soul, the soul. Basic idea, aaj ki sarkar ka hai, it is a control idea. When you want control, that means you want to control the Supreme Court, you want to control the Election Commission, you want to control the VCs, you want to control everything. So that's the problem. Unka jo perspective hai, unka jo ideological jo jo soch hai, jaroor unke vision mein aur unke implementation mein aage chalkar aayega, jo desh ke liye jaroor achha hoga. Jo rajniti se yada samajik samasya hai na, kyunki humne kabi bataye nahi ki dalitoon ke saath mein atyachar hua kyu? Because we have never taught them in school. It's a power thing. They don't want to do it. Everyone knows all of them. With the Dalai, it's going to be a good thing. Ambedkar Ji said, Organize, Agitate, Educate. It's a good thing. I understood a lot of our things. I talked about the government's government. They listened to the whole thing. I feel politicians don't see the disabled people as a vote bank. One, because polling booths are not accessible. So I don't know how am I going to vote. Also, uh, I hail from a small town in Punjab. Colleges are not accessible. They, are, they do not have ramps, they do not have lifts. Also, so you must have heard of this word, Divyang. Divyang. What does that mean? Divine body. What do you expect me to fly over stairs? How old are you? I'm 20. 20, okay. So You're pretty impressive for a 20 year old. That's a big compliment. No, you Thank are. You. Thin wall between me and him, it broke away easily, so easily. He was so friendly, so warm to talk to, very understanding. He had a very attentive ear towards everything every person on the table had to say. Coming from the queer community, I'm queer. Trans men also exist. But how many times have we seen policies for the trans men? Just make one observation. She said that as far as differently abled people are concerned, uh, they're not heard. You're saying, the same thing in a different way. You're saying there's another group of people yeah. who's not heard. Yeah. He comes from Dalit community and he's saying, well, you know, I'm not heard like I should be. Your community is not politically mobilized. Her community is not politically mobilized, right? So the Dalit community has got together and said, okay, listen, we are going to transmit our voice. And Kanchi Ramji played a role there. Ambedkar Ji played a role there. Jagjeevan Ramji played a role there. There's a series of people. And they forced India to listen to their voice. In today's world, numbers matter, narrative matters, how you do it matters, coordination, coordination. conversation, that's very powerful. But it's a question of starting up. We talk regarding the issues and the challenges that we are facing today and he guide us, uh, tell us how we can manage a situation and how he can uh, also manage them uh, in their political level. See, we are, we are building our manifesto and what we are doing is we are having an open conversation about our manifesto. Okay. I'll put you in touch with the guys who are doing the manifesto. You'll see that I'll start to push some of these things. The very fact that he's shown openness in uh, having a discussion about this should speak volumes about his interest within the subject. Lovely to meet you. It was great meeting you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Rahul Gandhi is in front of us. Awesome moment. We can never forget.